Hey guys, this is uh, the official shop update part two. So uh, we had the first part, which was just, well, the or original video was me walking you through before we took possession. Uh, part one was all the paint was finished and now we have done, we've etched, acid etched and cleaned all the floors in here. And we also filled some concrete um, craters, I guess, if you will. We've got, the floors are all clean and acid etched. Uh, they need to dry for at least 24 hours before we can uh, apply the clear coat. This is my studio here. And then the production bay. You can tell by the white on the floors, you got a little bit of uh, acid etching happening. And then uh, check this out. <laughs> we just poured some Quick Crete, look at that, GMFD 2022, baby. So, my buddy Andy and I just got done doing all this, and then uh, we, we literally just put this down. There was a ton of craters here, you may have seen that in the part one video, and I, I wasn't real concerned about it, I just, it kind of looked funny and it was very uneven, so I figured I'd just smooth it out. Um, this out here is not my, parking lot obviously but you can see out there all of the um, nasty potholes I am actually gonna pay to fill most likely just that big one right there because I, uh, I don't want my clients in their nice fancy cars driving up and having to hit that potentially or if there's a boat that needs to be turned around I don't want them all up in that I, I want it to be smooth and work really well here let's Shouldn't we put those on the uh, trailer probably? I don't know. So they're not sitting on the floor. So anyway, we're gonna leave this uh, to dry until tomorrow. And uh, well, I, I guess, so the problem is I've got a couple of boat jobs to do, but we've got a tropical storm coming in. So I don't know that I'm gonna be able to get them done this week. So we'll be back in here, basically throwing the, the clear coat on this concrete, uh, possibly tomorrow. So. It's all done as far as paint. Um, I've got a special treat that I'm gonna do to these walls. But that's it. Shop update part two. Floors are prepped for the clear coat. All we've gotta do is let this cure. And then after that cures, we can come in here, sweep, blow it out, and then uh, just coat the floors. So that's the plan. We're gonna pack it up for the day. We've been working just for about, I don't know, three hours, Andy, today? Two and a half, maybe two, I don't know. Andy did more work than me. I had to go to Home Depot. So, anyway, there's your short update. Floors are prepped, concrete is patched, good to go. All right, guys, check out Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation. It's a group on Facebook where we talk about, well, all of my products, my processes, and what I got going on. Uh, this is the home of Infinity Custom Works, my new company. And uh, again, we are focusing on detailing and ceramic coatings as usual. We're focusing on leather and vinyl uh, repair and reconditioning, recoloring, uh, fixing your color, and uh, Infinity Liner, which is our um, in-house bed liner material it's a 2k two-part urethane that's tenable and all of that so we do bed beds and truck beds and all kinds of different things uh, so the other main thing is window tinting so those four things are what we're going to focus on but we do tons of stuff in between so infinity custom works should be open and ready to go in about three weeks so uh, we're working on this now Thank you guys for watching. And if you got questions for me, 813-846-4406 or check me out on Instagram at gary.dean.35. Have a great day, guys.